All right, here we are at the BBBQ Crip 2019, Clear Lake, Iowa. Uh, regretfully, my GoPro image stabilization is turned off for this recording for some reason, so the camera is super shaky. So I'm going to try and keep this video really short, just long enough to show you the last two laps so you can kind of see the course and then see the final lap. Um, so this course is really technical. It's got eight turns. You can see the, the map in the lower right-hand corner of the screen. Um, there's this long waterfront section with a little bit of a tailwind. Um, everybody just kind of eases up here, so I'm going to use that in the final lap to throw an attack. See that again in a minute. All right, and this turn that we're coming to is the worst turn of the course. It's super bumpy. You can see that in the camera shake. And that lower left-hand side of the road is uh, super duper off camber. So if you end up out there and you're not really careful, you're going to go right into the the grass of the trees over there. Um, and now we're coming up to the the only little kicker on the course. Uh, so I know that everybody is thinking about this little hill uh, with regards to the final sprint. I know that there's probably going to be a lot of people who are thinking about going right there. So I'm thinking right now about uh, where I can go before that to make sure that I'm the first person at the top of this climb. And I want to be the first person at the top of this climb because there's a few technical corners right here that will make it really hard to get around anybody on the way to the finish line. All right, so one last right-hand turn, and we are crossing the start-finish for the beginning of the final lap. You can hear the bell there. So everybody's taking it easy, saving their legs for the sprint. Um, I've let myself fall pretty far back in the pack because I want to get a good draft. I was uh, letting people come around me in the corners so that I didn't have to sprint out the corners for the last couple laps and because this is exactly where I want to attack from. So here we are getting to the waterfront straight again, and I'm laying out my attack. So my goal here is to come all the way from the back to make sure that I have a ton of speed by the time that I'm passing the people on the front of the group so it's hard for them to get on my wheel. I'm coming into this nasty corner um, and taking it my way. I know that it's going to be hard for people to accelerate into that corner, which will Again, help me establish a bit of more of a gap. I'm looking under my oh, my armpit here, making sure that nobody's on my wheel, and I see that I'm all clear. This is perfect. Going into that kicker of a hill, and here I want to really want to lay out some power, make sure I'm absolutely the first to the top of this hill. Make it really hard for anybody to catch up to me or get onto my wheel. So now my goal is to just keep it at 30 miles per hour. Cut these corners nice and efficiently get back on the power, keep the speed high, make sure that nobody has a chance to get around me before the finish line. Looking under my armpit again, I see that nobody's on my wheel yet, but they're getting close, that's perfect. All I gotta do is hold on to some lock up to the line, and I know I can take it. And there we go, another win in the book.